It's game five of the Dallas Stars and Colorado Avalanche as we are back here for another matchup here of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Son of Beast here. This time, this is about to be happening for the Nexus matchup that we have it all faced out in between these zones. Dallas Stars has won two games, and for Colorado Avalanche, they have only won two games as well. But now, the series has tied it up. The next one could be the 3 2 lead for each team's Colorado Avalanche or the Dallas Stars. Because of what they have here, it's the hardest game that they have ever faced here before, and we are not sure who will take it from here first. So there's a chance if the Colorado Avalanche takes a lead or the Dallas Stars taking the lead right down in the upper lane ahead. This is so much of a and crew ticks that are turning to be in the one extending game here for one of each. So this time I will not be uh, I will be heading to the post game show and right now the commentators will be out here for the next part of this game to show you how it's done. And that will be determined as follows. It will be OJ and of course Mepho. So these are the only two guys I will be commentating here for tonight. Now let's get you right into Ball Arena to start the game. Guys, it's all yours. Take it away. I will be seeing you back here for the post-game show. Thank you so much right now. As for me and OJ are about to be here, OJ, this is about to be the next match up here, heading here at the Ball Arena. Yeah, of course, because this is about to be happening things and it's going to be a lot of intense match up here at the Western Conference. So it looks like we're ready to get things on the show on road. We're going to have fun. We're going to see who gets a goal first. All players are hydrated up and ready to get going as the game's about to start now. And Colorado starts off for the game five, and we are underway. Here's Toes. He started here before. And Joe Pavelski, also with Robertson as well. And we have his late ace Makar here on the other end. Also have done some a lot of a great skill techniques here in game one and two. Barovsky also to toes. There's so much players that, that they have played here before, and so many to others. It was a lot of a hard working core that they have done it in their own end. Yeah, absolutely. There's something else that you need to know. They got some, a lot of intentions that their speed and curriculum out there. There might be a lot of the players that wanted to get right into work. This is how hard they have played, and that may be the only thing that need to get right to it in behind to give it another attack run. No skins right over to McKinnon. McKinnon sends up Shashana backhand, and it's saved. Goes right by Oninger. And here is Gabriel Landeskog, a crease crasher. The Chris Crusher always gets and got a lot of great moment out there. A Crescent out there, there's so much to get right by him. I noticed some of the guys that really wants to make the Crescent to try to uh, smash him along the board. But it seems like there's so much other, uh, other players that might want to get right along with that. So there might be somebody else who wanted to take it from here. Wow, that was not good so far as right now this will be a delay penalty coming up for the Colorado Avalanche, and they're going to bring an extra man on. Saved by Kemper, and that will be a discipline on the call. That will be a charging. The charging is not that good for Kadri. That being said, this is all that happens. When their man makes a mistake, you know that's a bad deception going on. And right now, Joe Pavelski with the big tipper. The big tipper really has gotten a great pressure of his skills. He likes to tip things in, and now he wants to do is try to get right through it and by. There's so much to other players that wanted to get right through him, and then try to give him an up for the attacker on the run. We'll see if Joel, Joel Pavelski has it up in credit. The power play continues for Dallas Stars, as it's under two minutes left here to play for their power play. Now Johnson will reach up forward front. 
swings up the puck, and it will and it will clear the puck down on ice. They have something going on right down there, and this was what they need to know to get right by it. It is true because that was all that happened. And another penalty coming up for Colorado. This is calling for for the for for slashing. That will be the three on five for the stars. Yeah, because of bad deception, it relieves this. That was a good call anyway. Because of that one, it was a little late here for picking up the stick lift. And now this one is going to come up to a 3 to 5 with the zone out. Kumper takes a save with the glove one. Now Murray dishes off to Gerard, and it's Hanks inside. Pavelski, he scores! First goal in a game five, and three on five is over. Look at how Joe Pavelski did. He made a great attempt to make the speed here, and now this is what he has done. So far, there the players are right on him. Because the other man can't get right by him, this is going to be a very tough one to get right by him from here. And that being said, he's getting a lot of a lot of weight out there. And he says that when the pass is up to Pavelski, he makes a shot. That's a great feat to have the tipper inside the paint, right in front of the wing. The Avalanche had never gotten a goal yet here in Game 5, as they only have some couple options to try them again. O'Connor flings the puck up across here to clear down ice. Comber went right around him. Comber tried to stop him. Pavelski up on hits. Just 30 seconds in the power play. With the shot! Body hit! Great save out there for the defender. Puck clears out. Now they reset it up. Segan right up in, right up to Hintz. Hintz rushes down, five seconds to shoot. And they will not take it in time as the penalty has expired. Yeah, that's a great call because that was a little bit close off in the range. Now they have gotten some another, uh, another uh, feed call. They got something else to do. Ottinger save and Landeskog couldn't rebound the puck. This is a lot of a uh, working transition out there. This is never gonna call. Backhand shot, scores! Mark Hollar gets his first goal. It's now to tie game. Look at that. That was an impressive run. The backhand was being inside of him. And when he when he had it all in there, Ottinger wasn't ready. And the Avs tied this, tied this game up. A 1-1 game in the first period. A great score here in between those two of Avalanche and the Stars. Right now, they might be looking for another goal to get right by on. That's right. There, there might be something going on that they could be going for. Another big take. There might be another one to go by. Ben right into the wing. Passes up to Bert Kudrov. And Toes takes it up after save by Kjumper. Cadre up to the board right in the wing. Bad pass sticking up here for Colorado. The Stars play on their own end. Right into the wing. Holding the ball in front. And now the toes comes to save it. And we got a fighting going on. The deception has not made for the cap up here for a cap broken injury. And yeah, that was going to be a very rough call because the stars are playing very hard on them. They're not going to do it with the right thing as they wanted to get right by them. They're going to need to find some extra help here with the offense. And it looks like there might be a, going to be a drawing fight in between. It can be very difficult to get right by him. Kumper save, and this one goes up to Gerard. Mackinac right over to Rantanen. The Avs take it along the boards here on, on the corner. Borowski unable to hit that one with the, with the puck control. Puck control is not very good because that all it does take here, the bad timing at the expense, and that could be a hard one. Oh, checked away by Rantanen. Gerard. Has Johnson swings it over to Barak Barakovsky. The Avs take it inside the inside the offense zone. The bad pass releases from Gerard but holds on the puck, and they will have to try it again from the top. Swings over the board to Mackinnon. 
McEnany inside, gets whipped around behind in traffic. Yeah, that was a very close one. This closest of taking the call, it may be a tough one to go in by. That will be a hard one to reach them up to try to stop the attacker from coming in. Ox out to Sutter. Sutter finds Raffle. Now he swings it up all, all around the board. The Avs find yourself here on average on offense. Hints back into the offensive end now. McKinnon's got the puck. Swings it on over, takes a shot. That goes out of traffic. Burkowski, McKinnon, saved by Ottinger. And he will hold the puck here for just 8.41 to go in the first. There are a lot of repetitions out there in between Pavelski and Mackenden. They've got some, a lot of greater average out there. They might be looking for someone to have the most saves here for the game in Game 5. And I was expecting here too. There might be something going on that we may have another one to go by. We haven't reached down to five minutes left here in the first period. So far, the score is tied up by one. The next one can be a leadoff change if there's a chance for Colorado or Dallas. O'Connor right to Murray. Johnson holding back that far. This is up to Newhook. Takes it around the back of the net. He finds Comfort. Murray over to Johnson. Johnson shoots, fires across, saved by Ottinger. No luck on that one. The Stars work on their own end on the offensive end. Hints inside, and it's blocked. Good play for Johnson, that was going to keep an eye on the, on, the, on the target. So far, it can be a very tough one to go by. It's the icing, oh, can't get it in time. Wow, Lindo has the puck covered out here. Takes it away in no time. Yeah, when you talk about the takeaway, that's what they have done. They got a lot of stuff here going in, in between the zones. You gotta find the attacker. Nisurski! Tight save by the pad by Ottinger. There's so many saves going on here for Ottinger for tonight. Going for another one. Landeska! Slap shot saved by Ottinger. Landeska! Can't find anybody. Back to Toast. Reaches back to the McCarr. One timer! That shot goes blocked. Now they swing it back with the Avs control on offense. Toes inside, shoots wide, saved by Ottinger. He has the puck covered and we'll have a stop here on the play. Those teams are in better shape right now in between the West Coast showdowns, in between the net. And McCarr will have to take from here. Now he swings to Abi Kubel. Helm won't take it in time. Tries to swing back to McCarr. Avi Kubo off the toes. Reaches up the strum. And a bad pass taken off here. That will reach up to the other end to restart from the top. Yeah, I know that was going to be a very hard one. There is no chance. They may have something else going on. Two and one feed. Out of reach for Helm. And they couldn't try to save it back to hit the lead. Gurmanov's got it across with the puck. Now the Segan comes in the paint. Reaching out. Save again by Adi for, for Kemper. Kemper, bad save. Toes reaches out to Rantanen. Moves it quickly to Strong. Stern, backing over his toes. Reaches over to Garad. Reaches back to Toes. Fades one, goes right back to Gerard. With the shot inside. That goes out of traffic. In between the zone, they, they can't be in, in there standing here too long. You gotta think of it ahead, you gotta make that pass even come better. You gotta get out of here right away. Toes right in the paint. In the feed! Score! It's a 2-1 game! What a make it snappy. That is the best one for Rantanen to try to stop it by. With the feed, this all turns out to be just like that. Just like the ever game before. And they have it all in front. What a feed. Colorado Avs take up the 2-1 lead in the first period. And the Stars are regaining their possession to try to reach out and, and control. Now here, here's another one coming back. 
Rantanen has his first goal in the playoffs here in Game 5. Barokovsky, great look, but off with the target of the save by Ottinger. Ottinger was going to get there in time because I know that Barokovsky was going to stop here and nearby. Now he needs to know he's got to go right through it in the attacker and try to stop them. Holding the board pressure can be a little difficult, difficult strength here. Rifle out in the front. And he's taking the puck away. Harley saves it. Harley up to Hankampa. Hankampa to Rodolf. Rodolf ends the paint. Right from the wing will be swept wide. Only one minute left here to play in for the first period of the game. And this is like a tight matchup in between the Stars and the Avalanche. Yeah, I know. This one should be the best play. They should be going for it. Slump shot wide. That goes off the pad on Ottinger. Rodolf go right into the into the wing. Offensive in his own. Strikes up the Suter. Sutter up. That's nice, uh, saved by Kumper. Cadre up and on board. Gets whipped down. Kumper to beats it. And it will be off target here. This ends up the first period. It's a 2-1 abs lead. We'll be taking a quick break and we'll come back right after this. Officials are set and all the teams are ready to play for the second period. The puck is dropped and we start now with the second period of the game. It's a 2-1 ab abs lead. Now he starts for Parakovsky. Missing up here on the board. Hasn't scored yet so far, but only got made the assist. Even turn out better. That was a lot of uh, strength that they might be picking up here because all that does turn out. It might be a very tough one to go right by him. Now they got a chance to go if they wanted to like try to like keep the range of the offense to make it clear. Offside is the call on Dallas, and they will get a whistle here with only 1901. There are so many face-off wins here for the Avs to pick up nine and three for the Dallas Stars. Now the Avs takes a win here in the face-off. Now pass off to Rantanen. Rantanen gets smudged down and the Stars are trying to regain their group on D. The D is very impossible. There is no way that they're going to try to like keep an eye on the rhythm. They have some, a lot of a courtesy to bring in there to step on right up. The poke check saved here and it goes right back and Mackinan will have to try to help him out. Joe's out front, passes off to Mackinan, moves over to McCarr and it goes with a bad pass. Mackinan saves it again. Gerard shoots, save. Korkowski unable to answer. The answering of the call was definitely not even to, not even right, but that was going to be a very tough one to try to stop them. That could have been a good one. Gerard deeping it up over to Rantanen. The Avs picking up steam and he goes down on the board. And he gets squished up again. There's so many other players. They wanted to try to attack it right away. That's over to Hannes Cannon. Up to Pavelski. Pavelski right past in the neutral zone. Hates off the shot. Here it goes off on Kumpo. Nagushkin. Scott it across. Right over to Landeskog. 3 on 1 opportunity. Kadre couldn't save it. Then right over to Guranov. Guranov up to center. Now they move the puck in forward. Kadre up back in the offensive end. Sweeps over, Linus Scott, SCORE! Great feed by Kadri. Well, with Linus Scott, he has it all in front of the board. But when he goes on right, he shifts the gear. And now he has his shot turning out to be on the uh, other angle. Now you can't even see, but the goalie was going to try to uh, pick it up and, and further to try to mech him around to help them try to knock them at the same time. The Avs work up here with a 3-1 lead here as it's now a, now a two-point trail, two-point lead. Now he switches up. 
Switch up to Comper. Moves back to Johnson. With the shot. Off of Hottinger. Off to O'Connor. This is back over to Kemper. Comper. Lopper in the corner. Murray right back to Johnson. Johnson takes a shot. Hangs on like a chest here on Ottinger. Boy, he's getting a little bit chicken up here, but he's still okay. That's who put the stick lift here, and Comfort has it out. And he attack now. Here comes Colorado. Strong back to Comfort. Shoots off again on a glove save here by Ottinger. Ottinger was never going to make it in time, but now he definitely did have it all in front. Now he was going to get there in good timing. That's all he has been turning out to be just like that. Avi Cable beats the icing. He passes over to Dry. Goes right over. Gurnov in all alone. Hulk shot up away. Saved by Cooper. How did he get there in time? We only see here, there's some a lot of records here on the save by Kumper and Ottinger, but there might be a lot more heavy to make that match. The match is always that simple because Kumper has gotten 15 saves at least. He might be looking for another one here for tonight. Lock the shot here for Dallas Stars. The Avs working on their way back in the offensive end. Now we try to reset and finding a man is up and target away. Scoop along here with the board. Bangs him on the side. It goes. Fosca. Save again by Kemper. Strum inside. Now he's going to be able to help him out for the Avs to try to pick up their line out there. Strum back to toes. Right over to McCarr. McCarr right over back in the dish and over. The bat pass has been taken off. McCarr sends it back in the offensive end to the zone. And it goes out of nowhere. The nowhere is being seen. There might be a nowhere to go right behind it because that one is a very tough call. There is nowhere that, that the man can try to help him save it right at the time. Barakovsky right into the uh, into the uh, wing. Wing pressure. Two. There it goes off the pad of Manager. Back to Johnson. Reaches over to Murray. He takes a shot. Ottinger gloves with the save and puts right to chest to make, help them slow things down. Still lots of time left to play. Colorado Avalanche takes have an average of 3-1 lead over the Stars in Game 5. Now he swings over to Murray, right to Johnson. Backing over is Rantanen. Barakovsky trying to work it around again. Makadin. And it's Pavelski with this takeaway. Now he moves over to Robertson. The Stars are back in offensive zone, picking up stiff pressure. And McKinnon calls in for help, and they will take it back the other way. Murray in the corner. 2-1! That pass doesn't go in that well. It's in traffic caught. Caught in traffic out there. You're not going to save that time. It was really a difficult range here. That's what they need to do to try to keep it right. Robertson, oh my goodness, that's another stoppage on the run, and the puck goes over the back of the net. That was close. Over the goalie net, it may be very difficult for them to keep an eye on them, but that was no luck. They were going to get there in time, and they were going to try to get a goal, but it went too loose. McCannon right to Johnson. Man, back in control right now with the takeaway. O'Connor right back to Johnson. Now he moves into the offensive zone. Rantanen right into the board. Shoots wide. Chuck goes blocked up and held by Elinda. Jeronov right to Ben. Swings the puck around the boards. Now he swings it back over on the other side. Bad pass ticket by Ben. Hints inside. Good save by Kilper. And he'll hold the whistle here with 6.52 to go. They're very good goalies. Kilper was able to save it from across. He now knows his way. He's got a lot of great feelings about this guy. Colorado wins off in the defensive zone. Now Kumper will take it up across. 
with the pass. It goes knocked down. Oh boy, we got another one coming down here for the Stars. They're shining it bright. They're going way quick after all. They've got something else to do. Seeking up across. Oh, check them here and a stick lift. Back to Newhook. Flinging over to Landeskog. Now then go up to Juranov to Segan. Segan back into the offensive end. Juranov's up. Saved by Kilpa. Segan again. Bang shoots. Oh, it went, almost went in the net. Close call. Now this was a tough chance out there. They're going to need something else to make it quick. Another man knocked down as Segan will try to sweep things back again. The puck is knocked loose again. Right off. Oh boy. And another save has come up by Kemper. Now the Avs are sweeping up the valley of snow. Down in the avalanche rush. They got something else to go right through it. And with Johnson can't get the, get the puck in time as this clears the puck out of the way for Dallas. Nikushkin right over to Kadri. In the Dallas zone. Right to Helm. Takes a shot. Off of Oninger on the, on the toe. Toes to Picard. There's this one shot here. That goes out of nowhere. Klingberg recovers the puck. Now Raphael will take him out on the other end. Clinks the puck up on the boards. Now Colorado sleeping up here back on offense. Andre with the puck. Two on one advantage. That goes out of nowhere. And they will have to carry offside to reset them up with 323 to go. Still more time left. Dallas Stars hasn't got a goal yet here in the second period, but could be going for the next one here for, here for this period. Stars finds Raffle. Now he swings to Rodolph up to Fast Cell. The puck goes up loose. And right off inside, takes a shot, he scores! Right off in there in time, and it's a 3-2 game. Oh boy, this is this is what's gonna happen again. Where Olaf had gotten a lot much better pace out there. He was increasing his puck inside the range. Now Dallas is looking for a chance to try to tie the game. Now he goes right over again. Dallas taking his time. Pavelski up to Haniskin. Hinks right inside. Shot go in wide off the back of an iron. Strom inside. Takes a shot off of Ottinger again. Ottinger was going to get there. Just the right timing out there. That was a great save. McCarr shoots wide. Ottinger glove save. We're under two minutes left here in the second period. It's a 3-2 game. Still more time left to cover. There's still a lot of shots in the game in between Dallas and Avalanche. But there's still more to cap it on. Here with some uh, passing uh, effort here for the percentage. There are a lot of passes out there. There could be a good one here. There could be bad ones. There might be uh, another chance to try to shut them down. Now he swings it off to Robertson. Robertson goes right back to the neutral zone. And offensive zone. Takes a shot wide off the bar. Amber Kofsky. Tries to swing it across. He goes knocked down. Trying to sweep him down here. Rantanen was should have been able to make it in time. It was very tough. Not even all the players are going to get there in shots in the different zones. Because of that one, it's a hard job. McKinnon inside. And it goes nowhere. In luck here and off again it goes. Yeah, this was a tough one to get right by him. Angle breaking in there. Sawyer gets it back. It's trying to work for a tie. Stick with the lift. Chop blocked. And that ends the second period. Great call here in between for the Dallas Stars to hit the goal with the comeback. It could be a chance to take the tie in the third period when we come back. Now the third period's about to begin here. Me, Fowen, and OJ are back here, and we're all ready to go. Stars wins it, and third period's about to be the last one in game five. Here with the shot, love saved by Kumper, and we'll hand it off to, to Sturman. 
That's a great, uh, great, uh, uh, great recovery here. There's some, a lot of chances that can make it to happen. With all the player in mind, they have to keep it on eyes open here to keep it at once. For the puck around the board, there's a lot of them that need to go right by them. Toes clears the puck down below. This one beats an icing for Avalanche as they won't be caught off icing. This one, King King, can't go in there. This one was whipped around too soon. Ottinger hits the save and Egg doesn't handle the bait to bite the ducks. Yeah, because of that one here. All because the players haven't, haven't caught up of their attention yet. They need something else to go from, uh, from Rep D to make him D. Low and Pride. Toes right to Makar. Taking a check left here and a Kurskin. Got something to Kadri. Toes right over to Makar. Makar works up and ahead. Nikushkin tries the things again. Back around the board to Makar. Makar inside. Choose wide. Saved by Ottinger. Ottinger was going to get there in time. What a great save. And oh boy, we have a penalty coming up. That will be interference on Dallas for Ryan Suter. And this one is going to be coming in for the Colorado Avalanche's power play. You always know that Ryan Suter was definitely bumped out in here on the uh, Avalanche. And just so you know, this was ever going to happen because of them. It was too much to get right by him with the attack. That might be too much to go in for the attackment to try to stop the player from coming inside. And it's just too much to go through it. Interference to block that shot, it's tough. Here they come. 201. And it gets rejected away. Jura to toes. Toes inside. Takes a shot. Saved by Ottinger. Ottinger was there tough. Can be a close call in range. Now he swings up over to Gerard. Gerard face up the toes. Takes it over to Varowski. Takes a shot. Ottinger glove save. 50 seconds for the power play and 16.31 for the third period of regulation. You can feel that the energy is going to be happening here for Avalanche. This one is a 3-2 game in between. The Avalanche wins it. The goal shot off the target on Ottinger. A save again. McKinnon inside. It goes way too much congestion out there. This one really does stand out here. That was a really tough save to try to work their way around. Kadre takes the steal. This one goes in. Harley taking a steal. Ten seconds on the power play. It's right in front. And it's Kirk and it's Carl inside. The power play is over for the Avalanche, and now the man advantage goes back to full strength. Ranton back over to McCannon. And this one can be reached out of nowhere. Trying to hold the puck here. Suter in the corner. Take it away by Kemper. Kemper trying to get out of the puck here and says, that's all you guys wrote. Get out of here. Segan taking the puck in control. Back on offense, passing the neutral zone. The Avs takes him across the back of the belt, crossing the blue line. This one goes off a lock jacker on the backer. Rants at the country. Hanking shot. He scores! That's another goal. And Cadre gets a team up 4-2. Watch that tip to tip feed here on Ranchiden. He got a great feed in between here on, on Cadre. And he went shunned down. He was going to be bent over to have been wiped out. But not for this time. He was there all alone. The Avs have their extension up 4-2 in the, in the series of the Game 5. Still tied up, and they're looking for a chance to take the lead here. The run is no adoption. There could be another one. Just try to stop him by. The puck clears out. Mackinan takes the puck, and he rooses up here without breaking the icing. Now he moves over to Rantanen. Ranton up over to McKinnon. That must release this. Segan up to Guranov. The chance for here for two on verse one. His shot blocked. Barakovsky up to come for. 
with the shot, Peroskowski, he scores! That is another goal for the postseason. It's a 5-2 game. That's a Perkowski with a chance made here. With that questioning, this was all the play through that Doug turned out to be another great attacking the motion in from the wing to the zone. Play clock resumes here as this one comes down under 13 minutes left here for the third period. New clock back to Comfort. Comfort going out of luck. New clock trying to save him right from here. Segan right in, in the corner gives it up to Jaranoff. Now Klingberg in the other hand. Stars in the offensive zone. Klingberg up and a shotgun goes nowhere in traffic. That goes off in sight. New hook back the other way. Back to O'Connor, back to again on Newcook. The Avs work their way with the pass, and they won't pick up that play. Robertson, this one goes in traffic and trouble. Humper tries to save one here, and Helm will try to save it from here. Back to Humper. Elf to Strom, shoots wide, off again on Oninger. Johnson, right to Johnson. Tries to back him up before being struck offside. Sturm up in front. Backs up and Pavelski takes a steal. Wow, big hit. That went very big hard on a wrench. This was very tough that Joel Pavelski was going to get there in time and save. But not to worry, he got crashed. Oh, almost went off loose. Ottinger saves it again. And they will hold the puck now, now with just 10.02. Lots of tough in time here on time on attack for the Avalanche to try to get away with the man. The get away was not the only option. That was going to be a very toughest score to try to make them inbound. And when all that happened here, it can be very challenging to try to get back on offense. They need some help here to make the pressure to challenge that roughing call. Landeskog, oh, Kelper just got a save here before Landeskog tries to peel clear the puck down there. Wow, the big smash as Cadre still alive. Landeskog won't pick up that one. Now he will pick it over to Murray. Murray right back to Landeskog. The back shot hand. It's up in traffic. Pavelski up on Murray. Pavelski up in front. Pass is cleared out. They are bad on a star view for the Dallas Stars, and they will have to clear the puck down. Murray over to Nikowski. Cadre's got the puck right down in the offensive end. And he went slimming down. Pavelski to Sutter. Sutter right to Pasca. Back in the body check. Moves over to Hanskin. Passing it right to Vasca. Rifle up, score! Quick timing releases, and it's another goal for Dallas. Michael was going to get their confidence out there. This was a very toughest challenge that he has ever done so far. Now they're coming back in. Raphael has his first goal in the game here in game five in the playoffs. And now it's a 5-3 game. 7-15 left to go here in the third period. Barakovsky right over to McKinnon and then this one goes off wide. Buttle with a shot. That goes off heavy. Rantanen picks up his board. The Avalanche scoops up here inside the offensive wing. Open toes. Now it's up to McCarr. McCarr goes in trouble. Barakovsky with a backhand pass. Backing over to Bar Barakovsky. Takes a shot. That saves off again. The puck is cleared out. And this one is another bad play for the Avalanche to pick him up. Who's over to Barakovsky? Abs in control. Ranton and got it in time before Barakovsky went down. Oh boy, this is not looking so good for the for the Avalanche to try to pick him up. This puck is not going anywhere this tonight. They have something else to do in mind. They need to keep an eye on here to try to stop them. Wow, big squeeze tempo out there on the body check. 
Audi Kugel. Two on one. Off again on McEnany and a save by Oninger. Albert Lynch clears down the puck in the neutral zone. Now they will try things again. That catch the pass fired over to McKinnon. McKinnon up to Abi Kubel. Moves it quickly over to Toes. Toes can't able to hit their back in response. Back into Obi Kubel. Four minutes to go in the third period. Bad pass way too far. McCarr up on the O.N. Macking it up to Helm. Helm creeps it up through and through. Cleans it through on ice, looking for a chance to make them a great play for the Cavs of Avs to make the win in Game 5. They also call it here, that's going to be Avalanche, but there's a lot of change up here that could be going in, in between the zones. Dallas back in the offensive zone. Soder goes out of luck. Ends up on Gornod. Off the, the mask there on Gun Kemper. Kadre with the puck. Over to Nikoski. And he can't handle the held on the puck. 2.20 left to go here in the third period. Time is winding down. Kadre went and down. Back in transition, Gornod. Hits up. Shot is blocked by, by Toes. The Avs now pick up Steve. Back over to Gurron. Over to Kadre. Kadre shoots. Saved again by Ottinger. Ottinger was very quiet out there. Now he's going to get there right there down below. Johnson to Nikoski. Shoots wide. That goes blocked. Pull him up. Save again. And now the empty net is going to be happening here with a man advantage for the Stars as we approach down to a minute. Man up in front. Lundo up, save by Kemper. Kemper is looking good so far. That's the way to do it. Shot, why a little diving trouble? Klingberg back to Randolph. Randolph up, up to Hintz. 35 seconds for the man advantage. Try to hit up with the puck. O'Connor runs it up in front. He scores. It's a one goal game. Man is looking for a chance to tie it. Oh boy, the stars are going to get right by them. They are going to be an inside, and this one is a very tough one. They got to get right through it. The Avalanche and Stars are looking for a chance to tie things here in Game 5, and now they're going to do it again. Seagan out of no look. 20 seconds left. O'Connor, deep with the shot. That goes off target. Lindell up to New Hook. Back to Gurnoff. Jurian on to Ben. Ben inside the, inside the attack. That goes out of traffic here. Ben finds over Kumber. Shoots. Save. That's the end of the game. The Avalanche now has the lead. 3-2. You could feel that the heat of that one was going to be a very tough challenge out there. Way to go to Kumber and all the tape players of the crew did a wonderful job. So that ends up here for the game, and what a celebration turning out to be a one particular run for all the crew here and the fans. They got lots of stuff going on here with some, some clean shots and also with some helping great teamworks. So that's the end of game five of the Colorado Avs and the Dallas Stars. Game six will be happening back at Dallas after game five concludes for the playoff game. And that wraps it up. Me for the OJ are gone. Thank you all for joining us, and get home safely. Now we send you up to you, Son of Beast, for postgame. Thank you so much. Now here are the three star players of the game. First off, Nazem Kadri, one goal, assist, and hit. Turned out to be just like that, and now he had it in front. That's a great feed. Number two is Andre Borokovsky, one goal and assist. It all turns out to be a breakaway chance, but now this all does turn out, but it did have it up in front from the net of the goalie. And for number one, it's Landeskog. One goal and two assists. What a chance here for Landeskog to take the goal, and that was another one picking up here in game five. And that wraps it up here at the game, folks. With your final score, it's a close one battle of five and four, just like the first game that happened here 
that was the roughest that they could get there in time to try to stop them down. Yeah, they always knew that be stucking them down is like sinking them down in between the zoning action place. So with that one, I hope you all enjoyed this part of the Western Conference Game 5 of the Avs and Stars. Stay tuned as we have the Lightnings of the Bolts and Toronto Maple Leafs back at Toronto, Canada at the Scotty Bank Arena. That will be coming up next right after each break in between. And then we will head you over down, down here on the other end. So thank you for joining, and until next time, peace out everyone for as a while as the Stanley Cup playoffs of the NHL 22 dial. This is Son of Beast, signing up. We'll have a wonderful night here in the avalanche rushing snow of Colorado, along with the shooting stars of Dallas. We'll see you back here for Game 6 of the Western Conference.